My parents, who are affectionately known as Mama and Papa Coddle, have just gotten their second COVID booster shots. And I promised them that I would let you all know how they did. Uh, you guys probably know my parents. I posted about them when they got their first COVID vaccines, when the vaccines were just released. Uh, you've also seen them in their COVID vaccine t-shirts, wearing them proudly. Um, they are proud proponents of the vaccine, thank goodness, because they are my parents. But <laughs> anyway, that's besides the point. Uh, but they just got their uh, second booster. And I wanted to tell you how they did, what kind of side effects they had, and things like that. Uh, by the way, guys, I'm Dr. Jen Caudle, practicing family physician on our health expert video creator and the daughter of mama and papa coddle okay so this is the thing my parents are in their um mid 70s early to mid 70s okay and uh, they were really excited to get their second booster you know we're telling people to talk to your doctor and find out what's right for you uh, my parents knew right away that they wanted to get their second booster shot um, because they wanted as much protection as possible like many people um they have underlying conditions but their age in and of itself puts them in a high risk category and that's all they really needed for them uh, to get the vaccine so they got their second booster by the way it was super easy peasy for them to schedule they scheduled it at their local um like a local store uh and they live in nashville they scheduled it locally it was super easy they just sort of waltzed in and uh you can see them getting their vaccines one of the biggest things i wanted to talk with you guys about is the side effects afterwards right because at every stage we've talked about what side effects you could possibly get after getting the covid vaccine primary series the booster, the second booster, etc. Um, and interestingly enough, throughout the whole course, my between my parents, my dad, and my mom, my mom tends to have more severe symptoms than my dad. That's sort of always been the case. They've gotten Pfizer, and they also got the Pfizer primary uh, booster, and then the second booster was Pfizer as well. Okay, just so you have an idea. And um, actually, the same thing sort of happened here. Um, after they got the booster, they were doing just fine came home, they ate a nice breakfast, took a nap, which is actually what they normally do. It's not because they were tired from the vaccine, it's just because it's what they normally do. Uh, but later in the day, I know my mom was feeling some chills. She kind of covered up with a, with a robe, which is what she's done before. She's often had chills after vaccines, especially after the COVID vaccines and the booster. My dad, though, also had a little bit of chills as well, and they both took Tylenol, okay? Um, my mom had more chills than my dad, and she kind of felt just a little bit sluggish. Uh, also, that night, like that first night going in, into the second day, my mom uh, really had some sort of muscle aches and pains and she felt uncomfortable that night sleeping. So the Tylenol was really, really important for her. My dad slept like a baby, he typically does. Um, so he did just fine, no issues with that. The next day, um, they had just a little residual, you know, questionable, oh, do we have a chill, do we not? Overall, my dad was much, 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 much better. Um, my mom had maybe just a little bit, if any, uh, chills left over. But honestly, it was really about a day and a half or so, maybe even a day, and they bounced back very, very quickly, uh, which I am glad to say. So they did very, very well. I'm proud of my parents. Also, my parents did have, um, obviously, pain uh, localized at the site of the injection, which is which is common, right? We, I get pain at the site of the injection with a flu shot, with any sort of shot. So that's not unusual as well. Um, so that is something that they also experienced. Um, but other than that, they are they are back in action and they are doing quite well. But I wanted to promise them I would share with you how they're doing. They got their second vaccine. And as I've always said, uh, make sure you talk to your doctor about what's right for you. Let me know in the comments if you've gotten your second COVID vaccine, what your experience was like, how you did. Uh, Mama and Papa Coddle, thank you so much for letting me share your story once again. Um, guys, I'm Dr. Jane Coddle, practicing family physician, on-air health expert and video creator. If you've not liked and followed my page, I invite you to do so. For those of you who send stars, I respond to you personally. Personally. And guys, oh, consider joining my subscription group, Dr. Jen Superstars. And for those of you on uh, YouTube, you can um, subscribe to my channel and click the little bell if you have not already. All right, guys, talk to you soon.